So let me just suggestions. Turn down the lights. Oh. <laughs> and I will introduce you, my friends, with me here tonight. Oh. Nope. I, oh. I need to grab the right one. We have my electricity brother, Bad Sprite. Your local convenience store VTuber, Bad Sprite, has a really unique art style, and I absolutely love it. Very cute, and a big fan of horror games with super chill vibes. A good combination. Say hello, everyone say hi, and follow my friends. Uh, basically, what today is going to be is a celebration of VTubing in general. And so I have friends here to share their cool VTubing stuff. I can plug you into the ceiling, how about that? Plug him into All the right. ceiling! <laughs> Ceiling outlet, ceiling outlet. Just a filter. Where's the trans? It's just like the land parties all over again, fellas. Holy shit. Hell yeah. Get the duct tape. There we go. Ah, classic times. Oh, don't fall on the tub. Uh oh. <laughs> right over the, 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 my couch. So if you fall, it'll be soft. That's a toilet. That's my couch. Mm hmm. <laughs> that couch filled with water. Yeah, okay, fast, bro. Let's go. This one, it's a very different look here. Yeah, so this is oh. a really old design that I've made I made like think I a couple this. years back. And there's still no eyes. Still yeah. no <laughs> eyes. That's the one <laughs> consistent thing. <laughs> so... It's just Sprite's brand. It's just, we never get eyes no matter what. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm going to reveal your beautiful eyes one day. Is that your so... little chibi form in the bottom right corner? You already had that yeah, plan too? Yeah, it used to be just like a mushroom or something before uh -huh. I became a plug. I see. Yeah. So what was the vibe you were going for with this? Just a cool design or? Um, for this one, I was kind of thinking about like, I really wanted just to like make characters and stuff. That's like my hobby. So I mm -hmm. thought like maybe I could make like a sort of like shaman character that could like grab the essence of other characters and turn into them. Oh, yeah. So that's why it's like it's really blank, like a blank canvas and stuff. So this is like another idea I had with the mask and stuff. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Can, it does the different like emotions and mm -hmm. and things. Kind of like uh, I have the these eyes. Yeah. <laughs> I like love this design. This was super cool. It is a very yeah. nice design. It's like the thing about these designs is that I think they're really cool, but like it doesn't vibe sometimes. So I kind of just like experiment more. Mm -hmm. So like. Mm -hmm. The next one, I tried to experiment with like more colors and stuff, which is like that one there. Yeah, yeah you got the colors pretty mm -hmm. similar. Because like I wanted to like pull stuff from like my culture and stuff because I'm Vietnamese and I, I think there's like a lot of cool stuff about that. Oh, and one of the cool oh, things right. about Vietnam is that we have water puppets. That's like a thing in Vietnam. So there would be like these puppets that would float on water and stuff. And oh. There would be That's shows cool, huh? and stuff about them. So I wanted to make a, a water puppet VTuber. And I did, I also did not vibe with this one. I thought it was pretty cool, but I it didn't feel quite like me. I don't know. I ha While I was making these designs, I was trying to like pinpoint like what sort of energy I would have, or, like what sort of design that could like go well with yeah. basically how I picture myself, right? So I also like asked some friends about like if you were like to it's like I asked my friends if like if they were to like match the design like with my voice and like my I guess general vibe, what should I like try to do? And then I went on with my next design, which is boom. So ooh, that's big picture. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> very good. But yeah, so that's on. the final design that I came up with. It's very good though. I do love this the most, I think. Yeah, it, it kind so, of incorporates some el different elements there. It's very cool. Sorry, I just got back, but that marionette version is really cool. Yeah, wasn't it? Yee, thank you. So, oh. I, hmm? oh no, sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, so I really like this one mostly because it like took some aspects from like the other previous designs. Like it took the like hair bandages from the first one and like the jacket from the second one. Mm hmm. And I really like this vibe because it also felt kind of, I guess, contemporary in terms of like setting because it's modern clothes and stuff. Yeah. And I felt like it fit with the vibe I was going for. Oh, and yeah. Oh. 
very neat. I like that a lot. And then I think he had one more picture here. Oh, of course, this is your chibi form. You already see it. There. Yeah. Yeah. You see this before you. Yo. I know your little spooky little keys. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Oh, she's pushing me. All right, bye. Bye. <laughs> It'd be funny if that was the whole game. That was the whole game? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that's good. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was the whole game. Surprise me. Yeah. Yeah, I... I think, like, for me, I just mostly made my, all my own stuff. I made my stream layout and everything. And I don't really have the same story in terms of meeting other artists and stuff, but I want to get better at that. Yeah, it's, it's really fun meeting new new people. It's very cool. Yeah, it's funny how if you do your own art, it's... <laughs> you, you do less networking. You meet less people. You're like, mm -hmm, yeah. I am totally dependent on myself. But oh god, the walls, the walls are so high. Everybody else is chilling on the other side, chatting with each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, there's, there's benefits to doing it yourself as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. sure, like, sure. Like I mentioned, uh, when you like aren't artistically inclined like myself, and I know it's like, but you, all you have to do is like do your own work and just keep going at it and you'll get it. But at the moment when I was streaming, you know, obviously, I didn't want to wait months, if not years, to get a style down just to start streaming. But yeah. when you're like me, you find yourself networking a lot with artists. And that tends to be like the bit of a trade-off. If you're able to draw yourself as far as like your model, your layout and everything, your emotes, even if you do your own rigging, you find yourself like uh, kind of struggling to do the networking aspect, especially because then your main networking is really to try to get to other VTubers at that point. True, true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So why did you want to start streaming in general, though? Oh, That's right. OK. That's actually a fun story, because before I streamed on Twitch, I would like stream for my friends in Discord. And we always like used to do it like once a week and stuff. But then again, I wanted to do it more often and I didn't want to like call my friends over. So I just started streaming on Twitch instead so that if people want to drop by, they could drop by. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. That's really neat. Nice. Yeah. Do right, you have anything big coming up or new forms, uh, new announcements, some announcements? And... I don't got any new forms, but I am working on a stream that I think it'll be really fun. I'm doing a presentation about something and it's something that's like very niche, but I'm also very excited and passionate to talk about. So, yeah. Ooh, exciting. Ooh, cool. It's his yeah. eyes. <laughs> <laughs> if you finally only. get to see what's under the eye, what, uh, the, the hair. Uh, oh, well, can, also, you, can you pull the hair up and it just will be like hyper realistic eyes on this? <laughs> oh, my gosh. oh, that'd be cool. It would be like funny. that one scene in SpongeBob where Patrick yeah. looks through the glasses. <laughs> yeah. uh, just staring directly at us, the view. Also, you're a PNG tuber. Do you have any plans to go in live 2D? You're going to do it yourself or find someone, or are you just going to stick with the PNG? I actually don't have a plan to go into like 3D or live 2D because I'm having a lot of fun with PNG tubing in general because I can just make alts super fast. I don't need a rig or do anything. I can just make mm -hmm. alts like at the day of. True, true, And true, I think true. that's fun. I. One of my favorite things with collabing on not my channel is making the, the Fugi pictures i love making little outfits or just different th themed things super fun now, i've been finding that true as well lately mm -hmm. yeah the yeah. upside to bng tubing is all the alts the downside to bng tubing is your hotkeys <laughs> i have that problem anyway whenever i, I play final fantasy 14 and i uh, 14 and i stream and i'm i'm trying to like do anything my my like, you know, spell buttons are also my hotkeys, so... <laughs> oh, that sounds like a nightmare. My face just kind of goes all over the place. <laughs> uh, anyway. Uh... Oh. 
bit more of a selfish question here. What is your favorite thing Live 2D to do with Live 2D rigging, and what do you hate doing in Live 2D rigging? I'm... My favorite, my thing I hate the most about rigging is rigging. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> the same uh, here, dude. I'm literally just started, and I already hate it. Wonderful. Ooh. Yeah, it's. I'll be going. Bye bye. Bye. Wow. Bye. Let me give you a shout out too. Yeah. Let me give this. Thanks for having shout me. Shout outs. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye.